without delay. When I was homesick. No time to rest. You never let it show, but... about our lives, our futures. Well met. Is there anything you need? Act fast, just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Take that back, right now. Sylvanas got These tieflings prove fragile. I have a mind to end their misery myself. Calm yourself. They're survivors, not soldiers. I fail to see the distinction. Aridan's back with his tail between his legs. I'm glad for your help, but I'd hoped you were Halsin. Hells, I didn't mean it that way. Halsin's important, but you're the first bit of good faith we've had since he left. Keep your wits about you. Things are tense with the druids here. be keeping an eye on you. Understand? If I choose to kill you, you will not even see it. People up ahead. Something's wrong. Not like that. You are a true soul. You can't die. Please, stay with us. I, I don't think he's conscious. C can you hear us, Ed? You, not a step closer. A strange symbol glows marked on their flesh. And something within you stares in response. It's our brother, true soul Edwin. He's injured, and I... I wasn't thinking. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. The injured man locks eyes with you. The parasite writhes in your head. Your minds intertwine. You see his siblings, Andric and Brenna, new recruits. 
yours to shepherd. Protect them. Mind the true soul. He will... He... He... Edwin! Ed! Please! He's with the Absolute now. A true soul. Thank the Absolute. Edwin! Our brother. He was chosen. Like you. Do you have orders for us? We were reporting to Edwin. What? Are you... Are you testing us? The Absolute is our goddess. She's going to rip down the old world order, start a new one. Then we'll be the ones with the power. Well, you will firstly, true soul. You don't need me to explain that. A true soul, like you, has been chosen by the Absolute. You speak with her voice, and when the time comes, the true souls, you, will rule. Please. Any supposed new god would have an uphill battle. What? What are you doing? Your sword brother, now! Strange power resonates within the corpse. It calls to you. Your limbs move of their own accord. There's something of value, something your mind craves. Why let its host's memories go to waste? The tadpole has absorbed it all. Its experience could nourish you, strengthen you. Abandon their hosts as soon as they need to. Vile parasites. Chatter already, Tusky. I expect I am your first. I suppose I am as... That large, fleshy nose of yours looks like a mistake.
decadent then, lacking in economy, like so much of this world and its undisciplined people. I understand much beyond your comprehension. More to the point, I know the cure for our condition. It is imperative we locate a crash. You do well to observe more and question less. Yes, in great detail. It starts with a fever and memory loss. Then you start to hallucinate. Your hair falls out and you bleed from every orifice. Your bones will change form. Your jaw will split to allow room for four great tentacles. All skin will turn to gore and be shed to reveal new flesh underneath. Then you have ceased to exist, and a mind flayer is born. Words forged in steel. May your actions express the same metal. We must find my kind and be rid of the parasite. It's as simple as that. The first symptoms should have long since started, though. That is what puzzles me. Don't waste a step. Albert tracks. Its nest must be nearby. Dead. Dead Albert prey, no doubt. Feel the quake of its heavy footsteps before you. The owlbear's one good eye flicks away for a moment. You follow its glance and see an owlbear cub. The owlbear stares, then sharply inhales your scent. It sits back, its eyes still fixed on you. A silent ultimatum. You can leave now or step closer and die. Something good here, I hope. Mm. The saloon 
a statue. It is <laughs> hardly a place of honor. the spot. go. So, Gif, aren't you worried your kind will punish you for consorting with us? My name is Lazelk Chucky, and my kin will understand my need for servants. They will help you, but only if I Maybe I need more pockets. Responsibility to cleanse myself. They pursued the Nautiloid. A vain notion. I am one of many and will not be a burden to my queen. eyes. Another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you?
Lower. You saw another gith. Where? On the road, to Baldur's Gate. N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. Up. You can keep your innards. The locals prove compliant. A useful trait. I warned you, didn't I? You ought to reconsider keeping her around before she causes real trouble. Chuh. A shell so thin requires little to crack it. Teesling was clear. If there are Githyanki west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. I am unfamiliar with the... Well, I shall not say culture. Custom, perhaps. You will educate me on matters of this... Fey run. The Kresh holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the Parasite. By covenant, I can say no more. refuses both to leave or to allow itself to be used as you desire. a confession. I was too hasty to judge you. I thought you witless, gutless, unimpressively bland. Now, well, you've earned my respect and more still. You've proven your wits. You are efficient and dominant, in and out of battle. You've proven your courage. I swear, you would tear the horns off one dragon to plunge into another. And you're hardly bland. Your scent alone is enough to make my neck sweat and my hair stand on end.
Good. I want to taste you. Perhaps tonight. Perhaps later. But I want it all the same. Do you? Yes. Perhaps one night soon, I will come to your bunk and take what is mine. Until that night comes, I shall keep enjoying your scent.